you also might be thinking that I am in this kind of situation maybe for most of you like it happened with me that I trusted somebody and because of that I am in this situation. So how to avoid that further in future? Now you have to understand that there are different layers of trust that the zero level is no trust at all. The layer above that is transactional trust. For example, if I give something, they will give me something back. And that is where the most cases happen. That we think that if we have given something, we are opt to get something back. But we are not sure if we are really going to get something back. And that is where all the cheating, fraud, all the traumatic cases happen. The next layer is reciprocal trust, where I give something and I know for sure they will give back at some point of time later in life. That is more on the mutual connection that you have with the person. And the top layer is unconditional trust that mostly you find between parents and children, mother and the child, best of friends, a best of relationship, the intimate relationships. All these are unconditional trust. So next time when you start trusting someone or are about to trust, analyze a little bit in which category you are giving that trust to that person. If you are okay with it, go ahead. If Even if you fall back on that uh, trust category, it's okay. This is life, right? You don't have to uh, curse yourself every time for anything. Things happen, life happen and that is how we live. So these are just things to remember that you can apply further whenever you want to make any decision, whenever you are uh, like uh, talking to someone, whenever you have to take a step.